Hi guys, okay, so I'm making this video for the new consultants that are just starting and I wanna show you how to create a party. Um, so you're gonna log on to your workstation and then you'll see a screen like this and you're gonna go over here to the left where it says orders. You're gonna click on that and you're gonna go to create a party. So on here it's gonna say name your party and you can pretty much name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name this one launch party because this is what you want to do um, when you first start your business. You wanna to try to do first $500 within your first 15 days. So you're gonna click on this. Use a consultant as host. Again, you can use yourself or you can put in the name of the guest of the host. For the sake of time, I'm gonna use consultant. Use consultant, so you click on this little box and it's automatically gonna, automatically gonna put in your information. So you go to save and continue. And then right here, you always wanna click yes, where it says, would you like your party on your person, on your PWS, that's personal website. And you wanna click yes in case people want to buy off of um, your website link. You want them to order off of this party so that you get the hostess reward. So you're gonna say yes. All this is pretty self-explanatory, so you can kind of create your own party link if you want. Um, again, for the sake of time, I'm just gonna click next, and then next, next. And right here, you want to put an ending date to your party. This is always so very important um, because you want to give yourself a goal of when it's gonna end so that um, it motivates you and pushes you to stick to that end date. So in this case, if you're just starting, you want it to be the first 15 days. I would normally say 14, just so that it gives you time um, in case anything happens or there's a credit card error, whatever it may be. So right here, I am gonna say that it ends on the 16th. Then you go to continue. So there, your party has been created. This is the link that you want to give your customers to shop off of for those first 15 days. So right here, you can see you can copy the link to post on social media, to text it to people, um, so that it helps reach that goal, okay? So then I'm gonna go to go to party orders. So here you're gonna say, okay, it's all done. So when, let's say you close that up, that's all you have to do. So whenever you go back, that you wanna enter orders, you're gonna go back to orders, you're gonna go open orders, and it's gonna be right here. So all your parties that you have are gonna already be right here for you. So right here, I'm gonna say edit orders. And let's say that somebody ordered off of your party. So then you're gonna go add a guest. And right here, I'm gonna say it is Gloria. And her information is already in here. So the first time that you're gonna be entering people, you want to enter all this information. You wanna get their phone number, email address, um, so that it's already saved. So right here I typed in Gloria. Her information is already saved. For the first time that you enter it, you wanna put in the information because when you are, when you notice you get your website, automatically Sensi's gonna send them a newsletter that'll come as if it's coming from you, but you have got to have their email address for that information. So it might be a little time consuming at first, but once it's in there and they order again, you just type in the name just like I did right here and boom, their information comes in. Um, right here is where of course it's pretty self-explanatory. It says ship directly to customer. If it's going straight to them, then you'll click yes. If not, you say no. Um, keep in mind if they're local so that they get free shipping and your orders are gonna be 500 or more, I like to save them on the shipping cost so that hopefully they spend more on product. Um, and I have the orders come straight to my house and then I'll deliver to them or they can pick up at my house. So right here, I'm gonna say save and add products to cart. And my internet's a little slow. Okay, so then I, right here's the person I just added. I'm gonna click on her and then right here, you can enter whatever you want. So let's say she's buying a six pack of bars. I type in bars and then right here's the six pack. So I'm gonna say add build your bundles and then you go in and you say okay she wants um you can click on on all of them just so that you see them or you can just click on the name uh, type in the name so i'm going to say she wants you know these six and i'm clicking on them so i put it in and then i say save and add bundle so there it is her total you're going to notice that it's um it's not going to give you hostess rewards until you get to two hundred dollars 
and when you get to $500, it'll give you the free shipping. So keep that in mind. So I'm gonna pretend like I have all my people in here just to show you. Um, and they the party is already at, I, I, let me put in a diffuser just for the sake of time, just to get us to where I need to get us to so that I can show you what I want to show you. Um, okay, so you see right here, my party's at over $200 already. So you see that you're already getting hostess credits because once you get your party to $200 minimum, that's when you start receiving hostess credits. However, you want to make sure you get to 500 to get the free shipping. And I always encourage people to do $500 order so that you get more hostess rewards and you get the free shipping. So I'm gonna continue to add to get us to the 500 so that I can show you what I want to show you. So right here, oops, okay, it got me, I want to, let me delete one so I get to exactly 500. Um, let me add another six pack of bars. Just gonna add whatever just to show us. Okay, so this got us to 500. So let's say your party is already at $500. You click here where it says hosts cart and it says host credit gets $75 in free product and three items at half off. Um, you'll see right here, it says host reward fee is $5. That'll go away once you take all your, you have used all your hostess half off prices. So let's say you don't wanna spend money. I, I recommend buying just a light bulb, which you would get for a dollar, opposed to selling, uh, opposed to just paying $5 for nothing. So always use your hostess rewards. And to claim those hostess rewards, you're going to click on host credit. And right here, you're going to be entering what you want. So let's say I want another six pack of bars. All right, let's just say I want a warmer. Click in the name of the warmer. And this is really easy to use. Um, so you say, okay, love. And then you add love your journey warmer. And you'll see that it'll be deducting from the price of the hostess credits that you had. Um, and so on, so you just keep continuing clicking, adding whatever it is that you wanted on your hostess rewards. And then it says right here, okay, you've you earned $75 and you spent $75 already. Then you go here to host half offs and you click in whatever you want. Your host has half offs. You can use on anything and everything except Disney products. You can never use host credits nor half off items on Disney products, nor on our charitable cause warmers whatever it may be at that time. Um, nor on, normally it's like the baseball warmers, NFL warmers, that type of stuff we can never use using hostess credits. So here I'm gonna say I want light bulbs. Let's just say I want, you know, light bulbs for half off. So I'm gonna click that I want three half off light bulbs. There we go. Anytime that you have an order that's $200 or more, Sensi will give us an additional half off item, which is what they call the perpetual reward. So you go to party summary, and right here's a perpetual reward that you'll see. They give us this to help us with our business. You can do whatever you want with that. You can build inventory. You can tell somebody, hey, you know what, um, Gloria, you, um, if you book your own party, I'll give you an additional half off item. Um, or you can use it for something for yourself, whatever you want. It's entirely up to you. Um, so let's say that I'm gonna offer it to Gloria. I click on Gloria and I ask her, okay, what do you want for your half off item? And I'll click it right here. Um, whatever it is that she wants. Let's say that she wants the Love Your Journey Warmer. Okay, add that. So she's gonna get that for half off. She'll get that for $17.50. It'll automatically add it to her cart. Um, and again, don't forget to use that perpetual reward. You automatically get one every time you get to a $200 order. Okay, so I have all my guests in, I have everything that they want. So I'm gonna go to check out. So here's check out. It's telling me everything's gonna be shipped to me because I am playing hostess. Um, shipping is free. So you go to continue. And then right here, let's say I have multiple credit cards, then I'm just gonna click on the name of the person and I'm gonna put in her information and the amount that's gonna be paid. You just put in her amount, add payment, and it'll be deducting it as you go. Um, you can use any type of credit card, you can use PayPal, um, and, and then once the amount is at zero, you just go to 
add payment and it'll process it and send it all to Sensi. So now let's say that somebody orders off or wants a direct shipped. You can click on direct ship and it'll still count towards the $500 party and get you the free shipping. As long as this amount right here, the PRV is 500. Keep, on, keep in mind that it's PRV. PRV is personal retail volume which means that that's before taxes, before shipping, before anything, and that's what's gonna get you your hostess rewards and get you to the $500 mark. Um, if somebody shops off of your website, you wanna make sure that they order off of this party. So I'm gonna go on to my website um, so that I can show you how to do that. You wanna make sure they shop off of the party so that the party gets that credit. If they go just off of your website and they don't part shop off of that party, that party's not gonna help you get to the 500, nor will it get you the hostess credits. So when they go to your website, you either give them that link, and if they shop right off of that link, then you're good. But if they go to your website, you want them to go here where it says My Parties, and they're gonna click on that party. So right here, it's a launch party. Confirm that you're shopping off that party and then they can go and add whatever they want to their cart so that that party gets the credit. So I hope this makes sense. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's entering your, that's how to enter your first party or any party for that matter. And it's showing you how to create a party link and to make sure that people are shopping off of that party link so that that party gets credit. So I hope that you found this video, video helpful. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Thank you, have a great day.